Hey everybody, it's Andy, a.k.a. Max Writer. We are back with another unboxing video. This one's coming from Chaosium in uh, Brainerd, Minnesota. And if it's, it's what I think it is, it is coming very quickly because I only ordered this a very short time ago. So zip zip, I guess. Chaosium does a wonderful job with their boxing things. Lots of padding. Here's the second box. So you know. Oh, let's see. Uh, and then the second box is overlapped in such a way that you're not going to damage your product when you cut it open. So we've got the Pendragon Core Rulebook and the Grey Knight. <clears throat> so these are the brand new, um, uh, the brand, this is the brand new edition of Pendragon and the first scenario for Pendragon. Um, a, uh, the Grey Knight, I think it was already published by them way back in the day, but it hasn't been since. What kind of knight will you become? Will you fight to rid the world of injustice or use clout and power to take advantage of those beneath you? Pendragon is set amidst the glory and grandeur of King Arthur's Britain. Its innovative mechanics drive the emotional impact of play as your characters pursue glory, overcome life and death struggles, cross blades with ruthless enemies, and fight for love and justice in a world of brutal medieval realism. So this one includes a detailed look at the world of King Arthur and the role of knights and nobility, full character creation rules, six pre-generated character templates for optional faster character creation, the complete core rules of the Pendragon game system, including traits and passions, skills, combat, injury, and recovery, favors, honors, and, favors honor, and glory, additional rules for afflictions, obsessions, directed traits, ideals, ransom, and equi ransoms, and equipment lists, rules for the winter phase, the downtime period of the game for characters to train, age, and even go on side quests. A coat of arms generator to make wholly unique heraldry for your player knights. The Pendragon Core Rulebook is your guide to Pendragon, containing all the rules you need to play. It is a standalone product which can be combined with other books in the line to enhance your Pendragon experience. So, and since I ordered these directly from Chaosium, I got free PDFs of each product, which is a perk that I really love. And we're gonna take a quick look at this book, nice solid core rule book. A lot of art. Here's the Pendragon Chronology, Esquires, the Indenture. Responsibility. This is all about Camelot. Uh, and the Knights. Ooh, this is fairly thick paper. Oh, some of it hasn't quite come apart yet. The game system. So here's the Pendragon game system, and this thing really shines because it's really neat. Um, you're uh, certain. I've played a few times. I played the original first edition Pendragon. I've played a couple of the newest, one of the newer versions. Um, oh, nice, nice, very nice map. Um, creating your player knight. Here's the player knight. Game master players and characters. Parents Glory, here's your character, heroic events, um, random characters, religion. Um, you have to roll against your personality traits sometimes in order to do things. Like, you, in order to get in a fight, you have to roll to see if you're brave enough to do so. Uh, that kind of thing. It's very cool. The traits and passions. Um, yeah, there's your traits, your trait pairs, if I remember correctly. And those are some of the things you roll against to determine whether or not you will do certain things. That is a pretty slick looking piece of... <laughs> That's very cool. Here, hold on. Okay. Curing melancholy, loyalty. Ow, oh, crap. I hate these things. Yeah, I'm really not a fan of these, of these, to be quite honest. If I want to mark a page, I'll do it myself. Whoops, that's lovely. 
They just get in my way in the long run. I'm just not a fan of them. Uh, skills, here are skills. There's a few skills in Pendragon. Um, aspirations, character progression. Glory, there's the glory. Here's a combat. Here's the combat section. The other thing, if they're doing it the same as they used to, when you when you do combat, it's just like both sides attack. There's no there's no initiative that kind of thing. Uh, I don't know if they've changed that or not. Uh, I did get the the um, the box set, the little box set for uh, the starter set, which was really nice. Here's all your weapons. Things you can use. Armor. I really wish I had have gotten into RuneQuest or Pendragon instead of uh, Dungeons & Dragons when I was in, when I first started with role-playing. But I'm, d d was so simple and it, at the time, back in the 70s and the 80s, and it was easy for me to just do whatever I wanted. With Pendragon, you're, you're wanting to create certain types of stories, wealth, treasure, and trade. Um, and RuneQuest, and they're both very, very realistic. And of course, as, oh, that did get dinged up somehow on the side. That's okay. Uh, that's what's causing these pages to stick. There's the winter phase. So you don't travel in the winter and you use that to figure out things that happen to your family and that kind of thing with various charts. Notes on the new edition. Converting to 6th edition. That's very cool. And here's a few equipment charts. charts. Field divisions of treatments for coat of arms. Come on now. pre-generated characters, and a character sheet, and a nice index. Okay, we also got the first scenario. Um, this is actually a Pendragon campaign, The Grey Knight. Challenge Death's Companion. Arthur's right to rule is jeopardized when the fearsome Grey Knight accuses the king of murdering children. Sir Gawain steps forth to defend the king's honor, but Merlin foresees this champion will die at the hands of the Grey Knight. The Grey Knight waits for vengeance, and time is running out. Can you find the treasure that holds the key to defeating this vile foe and save the life of Sir Gawain and the kingdom itself? So it includes everything you need to run the legendary Grey Knight campaign, fully updated for, a new, for the new edition of the game. Meet Arthur, Guinevere, Merlin, Morgan Le Fay, and other famous characters. Attempt uh, to turn the tide of Arthurian history by participating in famous battles. Two prequel scenarios bridge the sword campaign, which is what was in the... Um, the box set from the Pendragon starter set to the adventure in the Grey Knight. A full chapter detailing the city of Car Carleon, including a full page map. The Grey Knight is a complete campaign and is fully compatible with both the Pendragon starter set and the Pendragon player's handbook. So let's see what we got here. We'll take a quick look at this. Oops. Uh oh. Okay. So again, same type of paper. It's very thick paper. Another one of these damn things. Um, wait, what's that say? Earlier version. This revised version is the third version of the Grey Knight, originally published in 86. It was first standalone adventure for Pendragon, published by Cassium in 1986. Uh, was written by Larry Dottillo, author of the classic Call of Cthulhu scenario Master Narlet Hotep, uh, along uh, among much else in the world's gaming and entertainment media. An updated version saw print as part of the adventure anthology Tales of the Mystic Tournaments, edited and revised by Matthew DeForest and published in, by Green Knight Publishing in 2000. This version builds on both its predecessors by introducing two prologue scenarios and making a few changes to the Grey Knight scenario proper. Most notably, certain characters and locations were changed to bring events in, of the Grey Knight back in line with detailed Arthurian chronology developed by Greg Stafford in The Great Camp Pendragon Campaign and subsequent publications so that's good to know um i like that I like that there's they've they've added the detailed history so the chapter one is the prologue scenarios um ooh. Huh. <laughs> chapter two setting the city of carleon there it is carleon and usk very cool it looks it feels like a roman Settlement, but I guess Arthur was directly after the Romans were in Britain. Uh, and then we've got chapter three, which is the Grey Knight. We've got a few of the various coats of arms of the knights. We have one of these ribbons. Try to get that in there. 
That is a nice picture. That is a very nice illustration. And then basically the scenario. Oh, here goes my dogs. Oh my god. Oh, neat. The art's really nice. I love some of these little uh, little illustrations that they've added uh, that look like illuminations and illuminated, illuminated texts and that kind of thing, the gray knight. And designer notes. Oh, I like this. I like that a lot. Nimue's song. There's a map of Britain you could give to your players. Here's a close-up of certain parts. Nice. All right, so there you have it. There is the Pendragon Core rulebook. The Grey Knight, again, if you order these directly from Chaosium, you will get uh, the PDFs for free. So think about that. And I'm really looking forward to reading through these. Hey, thanks for watching, everybody. As always, I appreciate it. And I will talk to you all next time.